it's the Traveler and Paimon! Hello, you two. It's been a long time. Were you having a really serious discussion right now or something? Just a regular catch-up. We meet here once in a while to go through any recent developments in our research projects. Ah, uh, so we just missed him! Maybe we should have hollered to him. He didn't look in the best of moods just now, though. Was he upset about something? If so, he probably wouldn't have been in the mood to help out anyway. Huh, upset? You mean Albedo? Yeah, he wasn't looking his usual self. Upset? Uh-oh, I wonder if... What are you looking at me for? I wonder if Timaeus' research topic is... <sighs> so boring that Albedo finally snapped. Sh surely not. It's not that boring. Is it? <laughs> nah. Anyway, Paimon wanted to ask you for a favor, Timaeus. A favor? <laughs> well, well, sure. How can I help? Well, Paimon found a bunch of super duper sweet sensetias in the mountains the other day. But if Paimon eats them all, then they'll all be gone. So Paimon isn't ready to finish them all yet. Paimon was thinking maybe you could make a device that you put fruits in and it turns them into juice. That way, they'll be preserved for as long as Paimon needs! Oh, yeah, I'm afraid that sort of thing is a little... uh... Huh? Seems pretty straightforward to Paimon. Can't you do it? <laughs> Paimon, I'm afraid you've entered into the realm of the weird and wonderful with this one. <sighs> okay... So how about you, Sucrose? Any idea? I I'm sorry. It doesn't sound like it falls within my area of expertise. I could give it a try if you really want, but... I'd probably just end up giving all your precious fruits arms and legs. Whoa, your tone is so calm, but your words are so terrifying. Oh, you'd think I'd be used to this by now. Well, as you know, my focus is on bioalchemy. Besides, keeping things fresh forever is just not possible. If you just wanted to modify certain properties of the fruit or their seeds, on the other hand, I'd easily be able to help with that. Alchemists usually focus in on their own research areas. Take us, for example. Timaeus, Albedo, and I all have very different research foci. Paimon, your idea is very imaginative. But it's beyond Timaeus's and my ability. I don't think even Albedo can make such an incredible device. After all, alchemy is not mechanics. There is a big difference between the two. Huh? Well, excuse Paimon for overestimating the power of alchemy! In fact, before Albedo showed up, everyone in Mondstadt thought alchemy was useless. Of course, we know better now. But even then, I have to admit, Alchemy is only one of the many wondrous arts in the world. It's certainly not some kind of all-powerful magic that can simply take a substance and preserve it indefinitely. Uh, oh, oh, uh, sorry. That wasn't meant as a criticism against you personally. Uh, Paimon just wanted some fruit juice! What's wrong with that? Oh, of course, these are just Timaeus's and my subjective opinions on the matter. If you're really intent on pursuing this wondrous device, you can try your luck asking Albedo. But I wouldn't get your hopes up. If he has no idea how to make one either, you'll have to give up on the idea. Uh, he doesn't seem to be in a good mood today, though. What if he ignores us? He won't. Albedo is not that kind of person. Hey, so where is Albedo heading to anyway? Dragon Spy? Unless he specifically says otherwise, Dragonspine is where he usually goes. He seems particularly fond of that place. And somehow, the cold doesn't seem to bother him at all. Then let's go to Dragonspine to find him! Come on, there's no time! 